Yo, what is up everybody? Jumping here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get a secret key in Bloodborne. This key will allow you to open up the upper cathedral area, and it's a really cool area. Now, to get the key, you need to go to the Unseen Village, and that is a little bit later in the game. There's two lamps there, one at the beginning and one in the middle. I recommend getting to the one in the middle, it's in the chapel area, and then you can go and get the key. Alright, so we're going to be starting from this second lamp that I talked about, and we need to run up this giant staircase. There is like this laser, so avoid it. It will only hurt you when it explodes, so just pay attention and it should blow up. There is a hole right here in the wall or the fence, and you can walk right off. Now this is where you will get the key. There's going to be a bell singing woman here. If you kill her, it will debuff all the enemies for you, because the enemies in this area will respawn if you do not kill these women and they are also really strong enemies but once she's dead they're a lot weaker and they're easier to kill now that those enemies are dead we can go ahead and pick up all the items there is an item out on this balcony area it's nothing too important but definitely grab that and this was the first time I jumped down here so I'm just kinda looking around trying to figure out how to get down to that item now I seen the item originally when I was running around and I was trying to figure out how do you get that item in this area because the door is locked. But this is how you do it and there you go. That is the upper cathedral key. And now we can go ahead and open this up and get the hell out of here. Alright, so now we're back at the cathedral ward. And we're going to take the elevator up. If you remember, I showed that one secret area. And when I showed that, it was in this area. I call this area Gravity Tower, but it's really like the healing church or something like that. I don't remember, but... There's another little secret I'm going to show you guys. If you take the elevator up, you can actually walk off right here. And this is some pretty cool stuff you can get. Basically, if you run over here, you might want to look around for some extra items. There might have been another one. There is a chest here, and I know that there's an item over here as well. And once you get that, you can drop back down, and boom, you're right back where the lamp is. And we can take the elevator back up. So I'm going to speed this up because I'm going to run past all the enemies in this area and we're going to get to the top where we can open the door a lot of people were wondering how in the world do you open this door well this is the way you do it you get the key at the unseen village and then you can run back here and the area that we're going to is actually really freaking cool I'm not gonna show the whole area because I'm gonna leave that up to you I don't wanna spoil anything I'm just trying to show you how to get access to the area but yeah the area is badass I have done it for my let's play but I'm not going to do it in this video. There's a couple enemies here. I'm going to pick up all their stuff because I want them bullets. And here we go. We're going to open up the door and we're going to check this out. Now there is a lamp here right away. So I'm going to make my way to the lamp. And I'm also going to be looking around slightly because this is the first time I ever came here. I just didn't want to miss anything. And there are some like really weird enemies here. I don't know what to call these things. I actually was thinking like, what is this? A bug? A aborted baby? I don't freaking know, but it's creepy, that's for sure. Alright guys, well that's going to pretty much do it for me. After that bridge, you will find this lamp and you can explore this area. I'm not going to spoil it for you, but it is a really cool area, so I definitely highly recommend getting the key and coming here and checking this out. Anyway, I really hope this video has helped you out. If it has, will you please like the video for me? Be sure to subscribe for future Bloodborne content. And I really do hope that everyone has a very nice day and peace out.